Hello everyone. What are we going to learn today? Let's look at the topic. Did you see the topic? Using the mouse. This is the sign for mouse. Now, I am going to tell you the uses of mouse. Monitor and CPU are the parts of computer. Mouse and monitor are connected with the CPU. All parts of computer are connected together to perform a task. Mouse is used for selecting icons or objects and opening or closing a program. The computer mouse looks like a real mouse. Take a look at this picture. Like mouse, it has a body and a long tail. There are different parts of a mouse. Let me tell you. Left button. The left button on a mouse is used to click, select an object, opening or closing a program and used as a pointer. Second is scroll wheel. The scroll wheel that is located in the middle of the mouse is used to scroll up and down on any page. Using the scroll wheel, the page can be scrolled up and down without using the vertical scroll bar on the right hand side of a document or web page. Or it can also be used to zoom in and out an image. Third is right button. The button on the right side of the mouse is called as right button. The right button on a mouse is typically used to provide additional information and properties of an item selected. There are different types of mouse. Let me tell you. Wired mouse. A mouse that is cabled to the computer. Another type of mouse is wireless mouse. It is a mouse that connects to the computer without a cord. Do you see that? It is wireless. A cordless mouse has a small receiver that communicates with the mouse. The receiver connects to the computer via a USB port and then it is ready to use. So these are the two types of mouse. What are the functions of a mouse? Let me elaborate. Pointing. When we focus the pointer to any object on the desktop, it is called pointing. Next is clicking. When we press any mouse button once, it makes a click sound. This is called clicking. If we want to close a program, we click on the close option. If we want to start or stop a video file, we click the mouse button. So this is called clicking. Let's see the next point. Double clicking. To double click, press the left mouse button twice without stopping and then release it. If we want to open a file, we need to double click the left button of the mouse. Double clicking is basically used to open a program. Next is dragging. In any document, if we want to increase the size of an image, then we need to press the mouse button without releasing it and move it left, right, up and down. This is called dragging. Next is drag and drop. Earlier we discussed about dragging. 
and now we'll see what is dropping. For instance, if you want to move a picture from one location to another, then first you need to select it and move it from one position to another. Do not release the button while dragging and while dropping, lift your finger off the screen. This is how it works. Mouse pad. A mouse pad is a surface for placing and moving a computer mouse. It is a small flat pad on which the mouse is kept and moved so that the movement is smooth.